Hey guys, this is Anthony Morganti from AnthonyMorganti.com. This is episode three of Luminar 2018 Tips and Tricks. In this episode, we're going to talk about a filter in Luminar 2018 called Split Color Warmth. In previous episodes of this video series and in my other video series, Mastering Luminar 2018, I've mentioned that I'd be going over all the different filters that are in Luminar 2018. Well, just for clarification, in some of these videos, you may see me demonstrate a group of filters, filters that I think are kind of related to one another. But in other videos, I'll just do one filter. And in today's video, we're just going to do one filter, and that is, as I mentioned, split color warmth. So I have this image of the seagulls, and as you can see, it has some warm tones in it because the sun is behind those clouds, but it also has a lot of cool tones. So I want to, as I look at it, for me at least, this image, the, the cool tones are just a little too cool. So I kind of want to warm them up a bit. And this is where that filter comes in. So I'm going to apply split color warmth to the image, and I'm going to close down the filters panel just so it's a little more obvious what I'm doing and minimize the develop filter, which I already applied to the image. So what is split color warmth? Well, as you can see, it consists of two sliders. One is a warm slider and one is a cool slider. What it allows you to do is you could take the warm tones of the image and you could warm them up a little more or you could cool them off. And you do that independently of the cool tones that are in the image. You could take the cool tones and make them a little warmer or cool them off even a little more. Now, for this image, as you look at it, as I mentioned, I think that the cool tones are just a little too cool. So if I go to this cool slider and I move it to the right, you'll see that I'm starting to warm up the cool tones. Now to demonstrate for the warm slider, let's say if I move that to the right, I would warm up those warm tones even more. If I move it to the left, I would cool off those warm tones. So it's really cool filter in my opinion. It depends what mood I'm in. There might be an image that I just want to make warm, overall warm, and I'll come in here and add this, and I'll add it to the warm tones and the cool tones and make everything warm. There might be another image that I just want to make cool, and I'll, I'll come in and I'll move both of the sliders to the left to make everything cool. Then there might be an image like this where I just want to kind of balance it out a little more. So for me, I would just take this cool slider. If I moved it to the left, I'd make the cool tones even cooler. Move it to the right. And just warm them up just a little, just very subtle. And maybe I'll even take this warm slider and move it up to the right even a little more. So I'm making even the warm tones even a little warmer. So I am, you know, making the warm tones warmer, the cool tones a little warmer, but the ratio is probably still the same. But I think it's more visually appealing, at least it is to me. And it's going to be very subtle. So I'm going to turn it off and turn it on. And turn it off and turn it on. So I could come back here, maybe take these cool tones even a little more uh, warm, off, on. And I think it brings out these uh, sun rays a little more too. There's off and there's on. So that's the split color warmth filter. Experiment with it. See where it works well for you on your images and how it could help you achieve your vision. Thank you, everyone that watches my videos. I truly do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.